Hello my good people and welcome back to another video. So this hair is from IC Hair and I've worked with them a few times so pretty excited again to work with them. Okay so I'm going to try and do a water dye guys. This is not the colour I wanted. I was going for more of an orangey, um, tony, like yeah like a copper colour. This came out like Quest of the Clown but guys this is the colours that I've been using. Cajun Spice Paprika, Pepper Brown and no sorry Pepper, what Copper Brown. <laughs> Okay, anyways, this is the blonde wig that I've got here. Okay, so what I did, I'm not going to lie, my camera like when ran out of battery and didn't even clock and it stopped recording. But this is the process that I did. I wet the hair first and then you take it out and put the colours in and then just dip it in and leave it there for five minutes and it came out. And that's all I did, literally. So yeah, um, sorry about that, guys. But it's literally straightforward. This is the second time I've done watercolour. I'm not going to lie, guys. It was actually quite difficult with the colouring. You have to get the right colour before you dip the... <laughs> Sorry, but look at this wig. <laughs> I look like Krusty the damn clown. Okay, so as you can see, the, the wig took to some of the colour a bit too much. And then the other part, which is the back, it was really like... It's just two different tones of colours or three different tones. I don't know what went wrong. I honestly don't know what happened, guys. But this is the second time I've ever done watercolour. It's much harder than it looks, trust me. Especially getting the colour right um but yeah i didn't know if i wanted to do a side part i didn't know if i wanted to keep it long so i ended up cutting it okay so here is the wig now i cut it very short um and i curled it up as you can see my face was just nervous i didn't know what to do i didn't know what to expect i just knew that i feel like this wig would look cute with a side part so i did do a side part and i did try and do some like tight curls but they ended up flopping because it's yeah as you can see you just didn't know so i was just hella nervous about this but it ended up kind of low-key cute i call this a picture wig this wig would look amazing in pictures however i don't know in person but that's just me i'm a bit yeah i don't know i was going for a copper color so when this crusted the clown color came out i was like the hell is this but it's still cute um the hair is really nice i did straighten the hair before um curling it up and it, it's just so it's so nice it didn't dry out after dyeing it it's really nice really cute soft movable so all good stuff regarding the hair but the color i just flopped with the color guys it was a fail <laughs> But yeah guys, this wig is really nice, I can't lie. Um I didn't pluck I didn't even pluck it. I really didn't pluck it. I didn't bleach the knots or anything. I've just put foundation onto the lace. So if you're interested, all links will be below of the description of the wig. Make sure you click the direct link and go check out more IC hair um wigs because I have used their wigs so many times and I love them. Very nice quality wigs. Mm -hmm. 
Napumua kwa shida maya niumie Napumua kwa shida maya Napumua kwa shida maya Na kwa komindo nisha kwa ya so I ended up trying to just curl it a little bit more. Um, I wanted more of tight curls, but they're kind of just so loose. But we move, guys. I'm using this concealer just to do the parting a bit more. And there we go. There we have it. It was a fail, but it's cute. It's cute. I like that side of the head. That looks cute. I could have curled it up a bit more at the back, but the curls fell out. I didn't really curl it up too good, to be honest with you. <laughs> but yeah, guys, thanks for watching. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye.